Uh, we are going to do something I didn't want to do before. I don't know why, but... something I didn't want to do before. I don't know why, but... Chicken. Yeah, we decided to go ahead and do this thing. I'm not sure if this is part of the last video or a new video, but we're doing a 0-60 to 60 in Danny's car. Look at it. It's back there. See it? I can see it. I see it. <laughs> what do you think, Travis? Uh, I don't know yet. <laughs> in tradition, what, 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 is your, what are your predictions? I missed my turn. No predictions? No. I think it's going to go 0 to 60. How many times? Uh, I don't know. You're going to do it at least three times. So I, yeah, exactly. I ran, uh, the fastest time I ran in our car was a 394, right? It was it? Yep, 394. Uh, 398 and then we struggled to get to a 394 once we went to E85. 410. 410? Yeah. That's a safe number. I'm going to be honest with you. As snappy as it felt a minute ago when I drove it, I would say, I'm going to say a 39 flat. Uh, we got those big tires on it too. True. Big tires are going to slow it down. Tires. Those does probably take off, uh, I want to say two tenths on your ass car. I'm sure he remembers. We'll ask him when he gets out here. No predictions, Travis? Four even. Four eight? Four even. Four even. That's safe. That's a safe zone. Alright, we're gonna go do this right now. So what's going on man? Ready?
with the other tires on it, it'd be in the threes. For sure. That's good. It runs good. Uh, it was slow off the line that time. 4.8 off the line both times. Try to do one more, I call it. fast I drove it it's fast so 14 things one it runs it's not blown up everybody relax it didn't blow up two uh, it's short it's short about a pound on boost or a little more maybe a pound and a half we'll look at a data log three there might be some issues with the clutching so it could go even faster four these tires are heavy seven there's no launch control and 17 uh, I feel like on a cooler day with all those things, it would, it's faster than trip. It really is. It's the fastest car, uh, stock turbo that we've ran so far. But it's also, uh, only got 900 miles on it. <laughs> That's still yeah. broken in yet. Yeah. Still, <laughs> still new. In. It's still breaking right? in. Uh, so either it gets faster as car. it breaks in, or it's faster because it's newer, or it's just faster. It does have a bed delete currently, so that's worth <laughs> about uh, three tenths of a second, I think. Nah, it's not. It's fast. It's just fast. That's badass. I knew I knew it was going to be fast when I drove it on the side of the house. You could just tell. Could you tell watching the cars? Quick. Eh? Quick car. It's quick. Yeah. All right. Sure. And that's our call to go home. Let's get the hell out of here. Bye-bye.
was surprised it ran good. Yeah, it ran real good. Yeah. I don't know why it took so long for you to talk me into doing it. <laughs> <laughs> so here's my prediction. Uh, that car, we just ran a 417 with these big tires. No launch control. Uh, let's see, big tires, no launch control, and it's down about a pound and a half of boost. I say this car goes in the three sevens with big horns, launch control, and the boost cranked up where it belongs. Here's the thing: we're getting ready to make some changes. At some point, I'm thinking you're gonna are you gonna detune it to 100? Or are you gonna leave it at 85? That's the big question. Either way, uh, I think with the proper oil changes, 85 is probably okay because real in real. Realistically, you shouldn't always have that much uh, of the fuel you're running in your crankcase. No. So that means you need to, with a bunch of boost, you need to change the oil often because it's going to push through those rings when you got the big boost. Yeah. Anyway, that's what's up. Uh, but for sure, we have something else coming up. Totally different than anything we talked about. There's a part going on this car, and we're going to tell you uh, soon what that is and how much of a difference it makes with that part on this car because we're going to run at zero to 60s after we put that part on. So we're going to leave the car untouched as it is, other than that one part, right? Two parts. Two parts? Almost three parts. Almost three parts. Well, it's kind of all like in one deal, right? Yeah. Huh? It's kind of, okay. Anyway, so we're going to do that. So, uh, we'll watch see the difference between the way it is now and the way it will be. All right. So we ran a 417, the best out of three. Uh, the other one was a 4.2 something, and one of them I just had a bad launch. Uh, yeah. Anyway, that's what's up. So, come back and check out uh, after we put the other parts on, but this video is over. Yes.